Hi, I'm Fabio Varesano. In this video I show you my last uh, progress with um, the FreeIMU 0.4 featuring the MPU6050 uh, gyro and accelerometer from uh, Invensense, the HMC5883L magnetometer from, from Honeywell and the ms 5611 uh, but high resolution barometer from uh, measurement specialties. So I have here the free IMU, and you can see it here, and it is connected to an, an Arduino Uno, and the Arduino Uno it's connected to the computer. So I'm uh, I'm using uh, I've been testing the communication with uh, the free IMU uh, and then the, Andu the Arduino. I'm using the code which uh, Noah Zerkin has shared on my personal website, which uses the DMP. Um, motion hardware in the MPU 6050. So this is using uh, the prior proprietary sensor fusion algorithms running on the MPU 6050 rather than the uh, software sensor fusion I usually use on my free mu library. So let's give it a try. I I converted the no, uh, the code from Noah to output the same the uh, quaternion representation from my uh, free IMU library so that now uh, I can use the my processing uh, sketches to show the results of the conversion so this is the sensor fusion running on the MPU 6050 and you see that it's working quite good. I don't see m much drifting even if this uh, sensor fusion code only uses 6 degrees of freedom so only gyroscope and accelerometer but there is a little bit of drifting. Uh, which I can show you right now, but it sh it should be there. So it seems that the so far the free IMU board is uh, working very good. I still didn't try the nine degrees of freedom sensor fusion because I should be studying a bit. How, the, how this works with this device but uh, so far I'm very confident that uh, this free IMU 0.4 can be a very very great board so so far with only six degrees of freedom everything to be seems to be working very very good so let's also give uh, a, a look at the at these board signals, so the I square C uh, signal levels on my scope here, so that we can see how this this looks. And so I'm scoping right now the this is the this is the SGL line of the I square C pass, and you can see that this is very 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 good so the signal looks pretty pretty good and let's give it a try on the SDA line and no not any problem at all so this is it I will be working on 
we'll be working on supporting the 9 degrees of freedom sensor fusion on this uh, uh, trying to implement it on the HMC 5A3L of the free IMU 0.4 and I, but so far the initial in initial tests with the with this the free IMU are very very uh, successful so that's it thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned on my personal website and on my YouTube channel for more updates on uh, my progress with free IMU 0.4 thanks for watching and goodbye